Hi everybody, Craig from You Are Comped here. I have an extremely special guest, Casey Martin, VP of Player Development at Viejas Casino and Resort. How are you, Casey? Good, how are you? I'm doing great. So this is very exciting because you guys were one of, not just the first in California, you may have been the first in California, you were one of the first casinos in the country to open. How's it, how's it been going so far? Uh, it's been it's been good. Um, we were definitely one of the first in the nation. Uh, we had a couple that opened before us that we were able to watch and learn from, um, and uh, we had we had quite the surge last week that none of us I, I think in our years in the industry have ever experienced before. It was it was fun, stressful, but fun. Well, I can imagine because this is not like. Um... I mean, not like anything you've ever done. I yeah. imagine you've worked a lot of busy Super Bowl weekends yeah. or New Year's where there's a lot of people. But with COVID-19 and everything, you've had to take extra precautions. So maybe, actually, why don't you tell us a little bit about what precautions you guys are taking there? Yeah, yeah. So so to begin with, when you enter the casino, we're, we're taking a temperature of everybody walking in. So it's the non-invasive. Uh, they just put a little uh, device up to your forehead. And as long as you're not running a fever you're good to go. So you you do have to wait, Just you can't just waltz right in. You just have to take a little pause. Uh, it takes a couple seconds and you're good to go. Uh, face masks are required. Obviously I'm in my office right now and since I'm alone, I'm not abiding by the face mask rule because there's nobody in here with me. But uh, it has to cover the, the mouth and nose just like you guys are, are seeing on TV. And then it's basically every other slot machine is turned off and the chair removed from the slot machine that's off so you can't sit next to each other to keep the six feet apart. Table games um, was interesting. We started off with every other table game open, only three people to a table. And then we were able to get some pretty cool shields that actually divide the players at the table and put like a, a, a shield going on you. It's kind of like a, oh, this is probably not the best way to describe it. Almost like a cone on a dog. <laughs> where there's the shield in front of you and the dealer, and then there's the shield that comes outside of you. So now we can open every table in our casino, which is which is great for allowing people to have more opportunities to play. And you can have your same people in the household kind of standing with you and playing, where before you couldn't congregate around the tables at all. Um, so the dealer feels very protected and safe. The customer's protected and safe. You do still have to wear the mask. There is a, a bank teller type shield where you can put your hand in to place the bet. Uh, you can't touch the cards, unfortunately. So games are dealt face up. Um, but as far as that goes, I mean, other than that, it's, it's the same game. It's the same rules. It's the same payouts when you win. Uh, we just have to smile with our eyes. So we're all Tyra Banksing it, smiling, <laughs> and uh, working our eye muscles now instead of our, instead of our cheeks. So how... I mean, was this product that, it, you know, uh, separates the slot, the seats mm -hmm. at a table game, was that already, like, ready? Did some, or did they, yeah. some some enterprise and company create this within a couple weeks? Like, what was... Yeah, some innovator went out there, and we, I saw it all over social media before we opened, and I was getting people sending me messages, I hear you're doing this, and... You know, it, it got around. So somebody quickly uh, in the, the great country that we are, the innovators came out, took their product, made plexiglass and, and, and made it perfectly fit a table game. And it, 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 it pokes out and it's built specifically for a table game. And, you know, people have embraced it. You know, it's it's a it's a must if you want to come in here and play. And, and we're happy that at least we can provide that so we can be open, because uh, I think a lot of us would much rather be here than than quarantined at home. So whatever we got to do is what we're going to do. Amen. There's only so much Netflix you can watch, right? Yeah. 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 As much as I enjoy Tiger Kings, uh, my third time through was probably, uh, wasn't <laughs> so <laughs> I'm glad to be back. <laughs> so you guys, obviously there's a, a lot of eyes on you, a lot of pressure, uh, yeah. opening up. You have to take a lot of precautions, keep everyone safe, but obviously it's, it's a casino resort. It's meant to be fun. So how did you, how do you do that in your thought process? How do you balance safety and fun? Like, just walk me so for the safety side, we don't do any large gatherings, right? So unfortunately, there's no concerts. There's uh, the the giveaways are are your free play, so you can take that how you want to look at it. It's I can't do a mass line and, and give you a, a beautiful gift, but I can give you free play instead. So you know, it's 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 balancing that. Uh, we can't do large gatherings. We can't. The pool's not open. The spa's not open. But 
you know, what I've found is the casino atmosphere is still there. And it kind of reminds me slightly of old school Vegas when we weren't oversaturated with all of these things to do. It's gaming right now. And it's it's really been fun for me to watch people really just embrace their love for gambling without all the other distractions. Now, obviously, that will be short lived when we can have the concerts back. We will. When we can do the pool parties, we will. When we can do the large events, we will. But this is kind of I think I'll look back on this as a fun time to see the purity of gambling and people having fun with that. Very well said. So right now, I'm, of course, you you got to worry about large gatherings and that limits some of the events and things. Right. Like that. What what do you think it will be that trigger that unlocks that? Is it something that from the CDC or from the governor or like how, when do you think that will start getting loose and you can have more flexibility with the events you run? I mean, mainly the CDC. I mean, when the CDC starts to tell us things are safe, we're going to follow suit. Right now, we're doing everything to follow the CDC guidelines to a T, um, probably overcautious in other in areas just to make sure we're being safe, because that's the most important thing. Um, and as the CDC tells us, uh, opportunities to loosen restrictions that we're current following are there, th then we'll do it. I mean, it was a very big deal uh, for our casino and, and also our neighboring casinos. We got together as a group and collectively went to the county and the CDNC and said, here's what we're doing. You know, this is what we're doing to be safe. We presented it to them and, and we followed through on that. So we will work, continue to work closely with them. And, and when they give us the green light, then we'll take it. Now, you I've known you for for years since you were working on the Las Vegas Strip. Mm -hmm. and, um, I know you you've brought a lot of customers there and now you a lot of people are like, all right, Casey, I know you, I like you, I'm going to try Viejas, and they're loving it. Like, what is it about Viejas that people um, that may are accustomed to, to Vegas or Atlantic City or somewhere else, like, what what do you think would appeal to them about Viejas? So Viejas is different. We're not the glitz and glamour of Vegas, right? But we are a very warm and friendly, welcoming resort. So if a lot of the immediate reactions I get with with new customers who are accustomed to Vegas and casinos around the world, just like the people you work with, the first thing they do is tell me how inviting this property is. It's warm, it's opening, it's it's incredibly relaxing. You, we still have a Vegas style casino floor in that sense, but there's something about our surroundings that just kind of take the anxious level down and you're not in a rush. You don't need to worry about getting from point A to point B. There's there's plenty of machines, there's, there's plenty of tables. Uh, the people here are so friendly from the moment they get picked up at the airport and, and those who don't, when they meet our very first team at Valet, they're just the nicest people and, and they welcome everybody with open arms. And you almost, um, you almost feel like you're kind of walking into your family and friends you've known forever, even if it's the first time. And they're so happy to have everybody here. I just think that that exudes, exudes off of them to the minute you meet somebody. And it's, it's really just the friendliness. And I also get this a lot. They said we're the cleanest casino they've ever been to. And I think that speaks a lot for our, uh, not just COVID times, but prior to COVID times, that just how remarkably clean and kept up this casino is, is um, it's, it's special and it's really impressive. I mean, you and I both, I've worked for a lot of casinos, you've been in a lot and, and they, they really do. They, they do an impeccable job of keeping this place just pristine. And I think that's, that's why everybody likes coming out here or, or is uh, genuinely uh what's the right word they're just genuinely upbeat when they walk in and, and feel great about being here and i can vouch for that i came and visited a couple months ago before all this craziness broke out and mm -hmm. yeah people were super friendly the food is great and then um the tower that at least that i stayed in was yeah. new like the rooms are really spectacular big walk-in closets uh, comfortable beds like how i mean huge that is bathroom a huge bathroom yeah that's um that's a new tower, right? It is. It's our new adults only tower. Uh, it it creates a very uh, different atmosphere than than the rest of the casino does. It's very calming, uh, warm tones of blues, beiges, and it's it's really if if you're looking to get away and just want a place to be without feeling like you're in a rush or have to get somewhere, but want your Las Vegas style gambling, I think it's a perfect marrying of both. Well said. I loved it. I can't wait to get back. Uh, yeah. I mean, the, in the event, don't you also have, you have a big ice skating rink? During we do. We have an ice skating rink in the, in the summers. We have bowling, we have, um, we have arcade, we have, we have bingo out here. 
it, then we have a shopping center. So it's really, you don't really feel like you need to leave once you get here if you don't want to. So I can't encourage people enough we do have some special offers for UR Comp members. Um, great offers, actually. I really like it because uh, it includes free hotel stay, some midweek, depending on the uh, qualification levels, midweek, weekend. Some include free play. So the offers are amazing. You really don't have an excuse to go check it out. And one more thing I, I, I would be remiss if I don't ask you about the gaming. You did talk about there's a lot of, I mean, it's a big casino floor. You have a lot of different slots, table games. But um, so have you guys updated your slots recently? You have a lot of machines or what's, tell us about the gaming. We pretty much have the luxury of having almost all new machines all the time. Uh, so happy if anybody wants to reach out, double check if we have their machine. That's really easy for me to check on, but they are normally the brand new state of the art machines here. They've been that way since I've been here. So um, I don't anticipate that changing. Table games, we have blackjack, just like everybody else. We have Baccarat. Uh, we do have craps, California style craps. There's a slight twist with cards at the very end, and at roulette we have that as well. But again, that's the that's the fun California version with with cards and a bit of a flipper instead of the ball. But odds are all the same. Again, payouts are all the same. There's just a slight difference to get used to that most people don't have any problems with. But just a heads up on those. Wonderful. Well, I cannot wait to get back. I can vouch firsthand for how amazing the property is and how great the team is. Yeah, Most of all, Casey, yeah, you're doing a great job. And uh, hopefully we got a lot of UR Comp members that are going to come check it out soon. Oh, awesome. Thank you so much for the time. No, thank you. Thank you, Case. And we will do this again soon. Awesome. Thanks.